if it's already kicking in after four laps, that would be uh, that would be something. Well, this is something that I said again about Lynn. Oh, oh my word, that is a big, big incident uh, here at Silverstone. I think that's uh, Kuyala in the uh, in the Koi Ranen car. And he's gone up and over and uh, is upside down. That is Fuminelli, I think. So uh, that was a big one. They were fighting over 16th place. And uh, it looks like in Kuyala's uh, Beckett's to me. Yeah, so here we are coming through. Uh, yeah, the last part of Beckett's. Oh, and he's, and he's just misjudged from behind the speed of, uh, of, of Fuminelli, Fuminelli. Uh, as, as he comes through. Uh, the right-hander of Beckett's and then they've tangled uh, and uh, such is the way they've tangled that actually the, the forward rotation of, uh, of Fuminelli's rear tyres has fired Cuyale into the air uh, reminiscent slightly of Connor Daly's shunt actually very uh, much last so. year in very last much year so. in Monaco but yeah as you see the, the rear tyre catches the underfloor of the car and, and, will, and will ping him uh, over the rear of, uh, of Fuminelli and that's the that's the nature of open wheel racing I'm afraid but uh, all we can hope is that, that both drivers are are okay Fuminelli is out of the car and at this point that is an incredible replay he's already taken his hands off the wheel yeah and what an unbel great camera work wow and um, somebody's told him how to how to crash properly because that that uh, that position that brace position it is very protective so uh, always the way to do it is is take your hands away from the wheel uh, make sure you've got them close to your body and, and, and hang on don't try and right the car with your arms uh, I know that sounds I know that sounds crazy but it, it can be a uh, can be a reflex to pop your arms out the car try and right it so oh my